yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I just want to tell you why I wrote Jerusalem. Oh, hold on, no, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Um, I don't know if uh, most of you guys know that I'm the singer and the songwriter of the song. So I felt like it's important for me, wherever I go, let me share my story before I can sing the song. Yes, when I wrote the song, I was actually not in a good mood. I was going through a depression. That is why the song is saying, Jerusalem, my home. Never leave me here. My home is not here, but my home is in Jerusalem. Take me to a holy place. Guide me to a holy place. But can I also share something with you? That time when I was writing the song, I didn't know that Jerusalem does exist. I was thinking that because we grow up uh, reading the Bible. So in the Bible, there's Jesus Christ. So I was actually talking about paradise. I wanted to be in paradise in a happy place. Uh, but I'm so happy, oh my gosh, the, the lady here, I'm sorry, you, you, oh my gosh. <laughs> you disturbing me. I'm so happy that the very same song I wrote when I was in depression, this is the very same song that brought me here. Imagine if I killed myself. You guys you wouldn't hear such a beautiful song. This is a song that got us together during COVID. This is a song that brought us happiness, you know? Sometimes I get messages from people saying, you know what, Long Table, thank you so much. It's for two years. But then, through your song or because of your song, today I'm healed. So, before I can sing this song, I want to say thank you so much for your support. Your support means a lot to me. And keep on supporting.